Planning Committee Report Number 605, third reading of Senate Bill 15, Senate Draft 2, relating to energy. Discussion. Senator Sloan. Thank you, Madam President. I rise in opposition to the Please bill. Please proceed. Uh, I have been a long time uh, foe of mandates, and uh, whether they're in energy or in health care or whatever, uh, our mandate for ethanol has proved to be a costly failure, costly in several ways, uh, by requiring that 10% in uh, all gasoline, we found that, uh, first of all, did not do what uh, uh, we were told it was going to do, spur a local ethanol industry, and still, instead we're still importing ethanol um, from South America. Uh, secondly, while biofuel is a good alternative and should be an alternative, the problems that uh, we face with the mandatory ethanol would still be available even if you lowered it to 5% biofuel. And some of those problems include uh, non-workability on small engines such as boats and small aircraft, and also the lack of productivity and the higher cost. So I think what we really need are more options and more choices. Uh, for those people who want biofuel, they should be able to have it. But to force this, like any other mandate, shows that an education program has not worked. Thank you. Further discussion? If not, do we have unanimous consent? No votes for Senator Sloan, all others voting in the affirmative. 24 ayes, 1 no. Senate Bill 15, Senate Draft 2 passes third reading.